guys what's up how's it going so i was just actually right now writing an email to my uh, some of my clients and my also inner circle members and i thought that uh, i'm going to drop a video for you guys on this topic today and this is about how to be a great marketer and entrepreneur and advertiser and how do you win the game of uh, building a business successful business because at the end of the day whether you run ads for yourself or you do it for your clients ultimately you are doing it to grow your business you are doing it to make money and you could have your own reasons behind making money for example you want to make your family proud you want to buy things for yourself you want to buy things for your children your spouse your parents uh, or maybe you want to uh, you have you are currently doing it doing this as a side hustle and now you want to quit your job and you aim to quit your job and you want to take this up full time so that you can travel the world work on your own terms so basically these could be your own reasons why you want to make money but ultimately you are learning advertising or marketing and you are uh, implementing marketing running facebook ads because you want to make money and the reason could be whatever right your own personal reason but that's pretty much what it is so i want to tell you that uh, there was a point in my life and i've never talked about this in any video this video is not about any framework to uh, launching a facebook ad which i usually give in my videos and you can browse through my previous videos if you want want more of such knowledge but uh, in this video i want to tell you about in a very brief manner i want to share with you like i started from zero then i went and took like went from zero to hitting my first one cr online on the internet uh before that i was getting some success here and there but it was not a prominent success or something that you know it, it was like a, a complete uh, you know transformational success but then that happened and the moment i uh, was able to hit my first transformational success and hitting eight figures because now i had that on my portfolio that hey i did 8 cr or 1 cr 8 cr that also will happen very soon but yeah 1 cr and uh, and after that like i took it took that funnel from 0 to like 1.5 cr and then i failed okay and i was not able to scale that funnel and uh, that experience taught me a lot and i want to share with you Uh, a message today it's like a heart to heart message okay and it is and i'm going to give you an example have you ever seen shark tank i'm pretty sure you you did you have and you probably do already and uh and have you ever felt like why the heck did they not invest in this business it was such a cool idea have you ever felt like that i actually wrote the same email and that's why i'm reading it from here uh this is on my pc right now as you can see so i dropped this email complete transparency so did you ever feel like that like why the heck did they not invest in this business it was such a cool idea and on the contrary you probably would have also have felt like why did they invest in this business idea it was so lame nothing cool about it let me tell you why and the reason is in the words of a legend that it is not it is not it is never about the idea it is about the one executing it it is always about the one executing it which means it is more about who we are as a person that makes an idea become successful right uh, you will see that you observe if you scroll through my previous videos uh, on this channel you will see that i think it's been about 30 days i don't even have the count anymore because i'm just doing it because i've committed myself to it and uh, uh, that's my personal goal right but i committed that i'm going to do it for 90 days and see where it takes me and i'm supremely glad that i did it because you guys have been uh, like awesome and that's all that i can say and uh, and it just pushes me and motivates me to just show up every day and it's like a 10 20 minute routine every day that i have followed and uh, i i committed to it and i'm so far i have been able to stick to it for the first time ever in my life uh, because i tried to do this uh, before but never was able to never take it to the finish line but seems like i'm doing better so it is always about who we are as a person and i feel that there is one non negotiable trait that we that uh, is a non negotiable trait personality trait required to become successful in business in marketing and advertising and that is commitment which means it's not about walking it's not about talking the talk but actually about walking the talk 
and uh, unfortunately what happens is that a lot of people uh, they talk more than they do and which ends up spreading not so practiced knowledge or information online and which is what creates a lot of uh, failures i feel right uh, and that's the reason why what i aim to do through my content is just be very raw and real and transparent as much as i can so that i can share the experiences that i'm gathering after implementing things and growing my business and growing myself as a person and uh, i feel that if if you truly want to become that successful advertiser you want to make money through facebook ads you want to grow your business or your client's business you want to do that there are certain uh, attributes required as a person that is going to take you far and one of those attributes is definitely a commitment you know being a man of your words and another one is patience right another supremely important uh, because uh, advertising is going to test you at all the different stages and uh, sometimes you're going to get some amazing results and a lot of times you're not going to get the results you want so and all that you have to do and i'll tell you that 8 out of 10 times all that it actually requires is patience because i feel that when we get started you know we want the results the next day and uh, we get some results from our ads for one week and then after one week our ads stop performing for a few days and we get impatient and then we start hitting the buttons and pressing the buttons and everything starts to break from that point because now we are changing so many things and we have so many moving parts now because we now launch a bunch of shit out there and then we don't know what's broken what's what's not why something is not working why something is working and then we don't even know because we're not able to spot that and then we don't know how to multiply what is working and how to get rid of what's not working because we take wrong decisions because of implementing so many things just because we became impatient so it has nothing to do with uh, you know a secret to facebook ad success it has everything to do with who we are as a person and um, you could follow my mechanisms or processes or you could follow anybody's mechanisms or processes and i really have nothing against anyone like you can just do whatever you can do abo you can do cbos you can do one campaign methods that i talk about and i teach and i use myself or you could do whatever you want to whoever you want to listen to but all that it matters is that it's never about the idea but mostly it is about the one executing the idea and after i made you know experience that failure of uh, hitting you know 1.5 cr and then losing uh, i wouldn't yeah i mean i would want to say call it as i failed after that because then it becomes my fuel to keep going it pushes me hard to just uh, push myself forward and uh, and after that i realized that uh, how you go from point a to point b is not how you go from point b to point c sometimes what i mean is how you go from 0 to 1 cr in your business is not going to be the way you will go from 1 to 10 cr uh and at every different and growth in life and in business comes from comes in different stages it comes from different at different levels and at every level that we pass through uh it challenges us it pushes us to become a different person uh, a better version of ourselves and at the same time of a uh, evolving as a person uh, becoming you can say for the lack of better way of saying it becoming who we probably are not and uh, there will always be two options two choices to make right becoming the person who we are not in a negative sense and becoming the person who we are who we are not in a positive sense which means getting rid of our toxic habits and then developing some new healthy habits will make us become a better person right or we can become a person who we are not so if we don't have toxic habits but we become successful and then we develop those toxic habits and now we suddenly are a person who we were not and uh, but in a negative sense right so it's totally on us how what choice we make uh, at every stage but ultimately it is going to be about becoming the person that we must become in order to get the success that we all desire and uh, i feel that one of those a few of those character traits that i see people missing out on and this could be probably you know very it may just sound very cliche to you like what is rohan has become a life coach or what uh, but i'll tell you that i do that all the time and even when i talk to my students minor circle people my clients everybody i always talk about these things and i tell them that that hey you know what you'll i'll give you an, i'll give you an example you'll observe throughout my content that i am very transparent right a lot of you guys tell me that you just give out like 
information completely with transparent transparency and openly and you have shared all your frameworks and methods and this is like a course and people will charge one lakh for something like that and why do you do it and the reason is that it's never about the information like i said it's never about the idea it's about the one executing it whatever i help people with is an execution like even when i coach it's more about execute and ex- i cannot co- if if i'm coaching or teaching somebody i cannot make them become an executionist or a master executionist if i don't tell them to become a person they must become because otherwise what are the frameworks going to do if you are not if you're not approaching the game with the correct mindset and correct the personality character trait right and that's why having those character traits are very very important it's these are like non negotiables and you will see me not walking not talking the talk but actually walking the talk you'll see me that i carry 100% transparency in my uh in my approach and the reason why i do that is because i like to keep it this way uh, why i do that is because i want to just spread awareness uh and i just want to do whatever i can with complete honesty because it's more about who we are as a person that matters because it's not about what we achieve it is more about who we become while we are achieving it and uh, that is what i just wanted to share uh, as a message with you guys today that it is also about uh, becoming the person you must become if you are not able to spend time on research and you are thinking because if you have i'll tell you why i wanted to share this because if you have a very shortcut mind right like mindset you will be like i want to just make one cr in 3 months for instance it's good to be ambitious but sometimes you need to have realistic goals also so that you don't experience that those uh uh those heartbreaks right because uh, because just because you had unrealistic goals so it is uh, so like for example i tell you there's so many people i have coached and i still do that and i have my clients and i see people becoming very impatient and uh, not doing the boring work in the words of alex hermosi uh doing the boring work is what makes you rich right so for example in the world of marketing advertising and business building market research is one of those boring activities that will bore you to death right it's like very very boring uh but i'm telling you that it's that activity that will help you become the the best at what you do it will help you grow your business uh, to the moon take your business to the moon uh, give your ads that selling power that you require make your business grow like multifold it's only because you will do doing the you will be doing the boring work which is market research this is just one idea but 90% people fail to do that because they just become very impatient because they just want they have a very shortcut mindset and they want like overnight success and then a lot of people a lot of you guys also tonight uh, tonight bol raha pata nahi why but tonight nahi the na okay a lot of people uh, uh, are going to uh, not understand what i'm saying and you'll be like uh, you would probably like like why is he saying all of this but i'm just being very honest with you like uh, you'll see that if you browse through some of my videos you'll realize that how i've openly shared uh, the the youtube channels where you should learn from about business building and you know having that kind of a mindset and understanding of how to build businesses and i openly share where i learned from or where i have learned from and the reason why i do that is because uh, the reality is that uh, i used to be very insecure but uh, i am not insecure anymore because the reality is that whether i tell you or i don't you will learn from me if you are doing that and then you will learn from other places and why shouldn't you right like even i learned from many different places and i think everybody does so i might as well just be your friend and just tell you where you should learn from because i learned from there and i became the person i am today because i learned from great people so uh, so there you go that's 100% transparency right it's because it's not because i want to do that because that's like hey this is my marketing style no 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 None, nothing to do with the marketing style it is it is from the angle of it is about who it is not about what we achieve but it is about who we become while we are achieving it and uh, the more we become the better human being we become the bigger success we start to achieve because it's more like you know the warrior mindset it's more like that and you will not be able to uh, win the battle or the game if you don't become the person you must become and you keep evolving yourself as a human being and that's why your focus level is going to be an issue you will not spot the things the, the way you should spot them when you are doing the market research uh, for example and that's all about it's that's it everything has to do with who you are as a person and i'll tell you that i used to be a chain smoker 
uh, maybe some of you know maybe you did not know uh, and it's i think i'm touching 3 years now that i have not smoked a single cigarette i used to be a chain smoker i used to party every weekend reality i am 36 years old today uh, i don't drink anymore it's been a long time uh, i'm a punjabi so i used to eat non veg chicken and stuff and uh, mutton uh, and fish i don't eat non veg i do eat eggs though because i work out but it's been a long time i quit that and it's not because oh my god it's so hard it is because i realize that it is all about who you are as a person because i saw that i always wanted to decode this like, hey why shark tank people investors are investing in a business that is so such such a lame business right and why are they still choosing to invest because they are always saying that you know what i'm going to bet on you i'm going to put my money on you so they look at the the banda the insan behind the idea right so i am just doing what i can uh, in the last uh, just i'm doing whatever i can to become the person i can or i should become to achieve the goals that i have the dreams that i have and how i reached from 0 to 1 cr i know i'm not going to go the same way from 1 to 10 cr because now that's my goal so uh, i have to change and i have to just surrender like that's that's the reality i can't run away from it and um, in the last 3 months i've lost 10 kgs uh, that's another transformation that i did and this is not some nobody asked me to do it i did it because i want to test my potential and see what is it that i can achieve and how much can i evolve myself as a person and as a result of that uh, the things will uh, fall into place because hows are the domain of the universe as they say in the by napoleon hill right that's what he says and uh, even i think uh, this is the same thing mentioned uh, in the book secret if you know the book i'm talking about hows are the domain of the universe and in bhagavad gita it's it talks about the same concept it says that uh, all that we have to do is we have to commit ourselves to the process and not the goals so we want to detach ourselves with the goals and commit ourselves with the process and forget about the goal because our once we are too much uh, involved in uh, living the process hitting the goals is just an is just an outcome of surrendering to the process and just executing whatever we are supposed to execute and hitting the goals is just going to become an outcome of that so uh, it's a very different place to be in it's a very different mindset a very different approach uh, for example i know for a fact that all that i have to do is i have to put one piece of content every day every day on youtube just to inspire you guys sometimes share some in depth learning and give frameworks and just to help people just to pay back to the to the world of uh, you know knowledge and people all the beautiful and great teachers and coaches that i learned from so just following their footsteps and just doing whatever i can at my best of potential at this point and here i am leading by example and uh, um I think that's it. So if I just commit myself to the process and just do what I'm supposed to do, things will fall into the, into place on the I think on its own. Like I don't really need to pressurize myself about how it's all, all going to become a reality because I have a process. I have a goal. After I set up the goal, I laid down a process that what are the six things for example that I'm going to do to hit that goal and I'm going to do on a consistent basis every day and I have to do it for long enough. to ultimately hit the goal so for example uh, i'm going to do it for one year and then i'm going to hit my goal if i do this for one year for 12 months consistently i'm going to hit my goals and uh, i'm 36 years old today and i feel like that if if it you know you could be 20 or you could be 40 but i think if we just go all in and just give one year of our time to the process that we are supposed to follow and not just think about driving a mercedes benz which is important and i'm not denying that you should not please do that have those goals but i'm just saying if we surrender not to think about not to just drive a mercedes but actually the process to become to hit those goals and then do whatever it takes to stick to the process which ultimately means becoming the person we must become then we will achieve the goals that we have to or that that we want to right and i feel that's how you become a great marketer it's not about uh, not about any hacks it's all about who we are as a person so that we learn the right way and we execute the right way this is mentor rohan today signing off i hope you got value from this video i'm going to see you in the next one bye